Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. In this video, we actually have some quite a bit of things to go and talk about in regards to the walking event that is going on right now. And if you guys are in the areas where you guys can participate in the walking event, I'd probably say go now if you guys can. We have been seeing quite a few places saying that their stock is running pretty low, slash like some stores are actually at the point where they're actually sold out. But as well, we also had some stores that were basically sold out pretty much at the moment they end, like basically opened on up. And some stores as well, kind of getting more of the trickle on in just all throughout the day. So we're going to have a lot of stuff to go talk about about that as well. Kind of talk about the experience for it and on top of that two reminders on some other various drops going on as of today slash update slash all that good stuff so hope you guys will sit back relax and enjoy the video itself as well make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new playstation 5 giveaway amazon links down below for the ps5 disc digital console controller twitter and twitch stream as well link down below sign up for weeble deposit 100 dollars you guys go get free stack free money go and base you guys go buy $100 worth of any cryptocurrency. You guys go and get free Bitcoin. Those are always linked down below. And if, without further ado, let's go dive in the video itself. So I'm sure you guys have heard we made a video about it earlier on today and talked about it throughout the week itself. But GameStop, as of today, does have a confirmed walk-in event going on for the PlayStation 5. We've had a lot of information in regards to this, and we've seen a lot of people actually go get some Ws. We saw a lot of people tweet at me, some YouTube comments as well. So if you guys were a part of that, first of all, we'll talk about, like, it's still kind of ongoing as of now. It's kind of my reminder slash talk about it. But if you guys were a part of the GameStop drop, please tweet at me. Please send me a message. Show me some pictures. Show me your actual the stuff you guys got. Would love to go and see it. Or if you guys even camped on out, you guys can show some if you guys would like. I'm going to show a few of the other various pictures of people just in the restock community out there trying to go and actually get their consoles. But I do want to go make a few notes on this. And this is kind of more the important stuff on this video itself. A lot of stores still will have stock available. So a lot of the stock was actually higher than expected for a lot of different other locations. So bear that in mind. Some of the stock numbers we were seeing were even in the 50 plus mark in regards to consoles that were kind of out there out in the wild. So if you guys are in the Los Angeles, Phoenix, Houston, San Antonio, Miami, Fort Lauderdale, Chicago, and Boston area, Please go and check your local stores. Please go and get them. And as well, the current overall stock for it is still the PlayStation 5 console, just standalone PS5 disc edition, Ghost of Tsushima a Director's Cut, Far Cry 6. You get a PS Plus 12 month subscription and then a $50 gift card. And it does kind of seem like the total does come out to $740. So in case you guys are curious on this, you guys want to go check your local stores. But the reason why I'm even making this video is because we still have been seeing people getting stock as of right now. So let's let's talk about this slash ramble about it. Kind of this kind of like my like, hey, like if you see this video, even maybe after work, it might be worth checking, although that might be like three or four hours after the fact, or maybe even two hours, depending if you guys are in the East Coast or not. But just letting you guys know, we are still seeing stores with stock available. We didn't we did kind of touch on that earlier on because it's number one bundles and number two is getting colder in some locations. And then number three, it is also just bigger stock available. So it's not as as crazy as regards to say like the Best Buy restock that happened not that long ago. But a lot of stores still have stock available. Some stores, though, I will go and say you may have to go and call your local store or do like a quick drive through and maybe go check out like two to four different stores if you guys are still trying to go get your console. But if you guys are, depending on what's going on, it's probably worth it to check it. As I've mentioned, we've seen numbers from 50 to 60, which is even higher than the previous GameStop walk-in event from like two weeks ago from the other various states. So this is actually going really, really good. Like a lot of people are getting their consoles. A lot of people have been chilling. A lot of people are confirming it. We even saw confirms as, late, as early as like 30 minutes ago, 40 minutes ago. So this is not like, you know, outdated information. Unless, you, I mean, maybe you guys see this like nine hours from now it might be, but I'm sure we actually might even see some more stores still having stock as of tomorrow so 100 i'll give you guys updates tomorrow so make sure you guys are subscribed with notifications on for that in case you guys are curious but a few things to kind of note on top of this too as well so even there's like a tweet over here too to my homie ps5 restocks from over here from jay mccaver harvard it's the same thank you over here i was able to secure the fourth line for a gamestop bundle in phoenix itself last i know they still have plenty of stock left in store i'll post a picture of the console too as well too as well so you guys can kind of go and see they have confirmed they got it and as well as the overall same bundles we've been seeing mixed on in we've also seen quite a few people even over late at night going and getting it so feel let me let me talk about a few more quick things over here so stock is still there some stock numbers it might be various like some stores may have sold out and i'm about to show you guys in two seconds but a lot of places were camping out like they're 
I was kind of I was kind of curious. I usually tell people to go check at like 10, 11 o'clock at night and kind of see how your store's numbers are doing. And then if there's a lot of people there, maybe commit to your car, bring a chair out, et cetera, et cetera. But it did kind of seem like some stores had like three people <laughs> and then some stores were fully packed. So that's why I kept on saying it kind of depends on your local stores mixed on in. So a good example over here too is like one over here saying I'm at the LA GameStop store in Wilshire. This basically this is even the pre the drop over here. And this is what I always mention too, is that sometimes we'll even go and have tickets mixed on in. So you guys can sometimes see that floating around in general. So there's people like literally out there in line waiting to go and get their consoles. It's like some of the stuff from later on at, as of last night makes done it but there's people out here in lines there's people waiting out here and stuff and this is why i sometimes say if you guys want to we do sometimes see managers start giving out tickets at like midnight because they just don't want people camping overnight they don't want people sitting in chairs they don't want people sitting over there too in general and here's like another good example over here mixed down in where we saw like we saw like an okay amount of people in the morning as right here you can maybe see like 15 20 people or so and the stores do have like 40 to 60 stock so this is why i'm kind of saying as of right now it's if you guys are in the local areas, which once again, it is if you guys are in a few, like it's only a few select states for it, as I'm sure you guys have mentioned, it's for Los Angeles. And there's more than just one store. It's like multiple stores in these areas, as I was telling you guys before, Phoenix, Houston, San Antonio, Miami, Chicago, and Boston. So like if you guys are in any of these areas at all, go and check, go and see your stores. The stocks are looking pretty good. And as well as I mentioned too, we just saw, we saw a lot of folks out there just, well, just sitting out in line. Now there's actually a lot more people out there than we expect. But as I mentioned many, many times, there's, dude, there is a lot of people. Like here's even like another picture over here, just mixed down in for all the people sitting outside, bringing snacks, bringing their chairs, just chilling overnight, trying to get their PS5s and all that good stuff. So I'm just letting you guys know, like it was a good stock, but some stores still may have stock. So it's probably worth it if you guys really want to get your consoles, float around through a few different of your local game stops. If you guys are in there, someone just even just subscribe on Twitch. Thank you. <laughs> if you guys ever have a, a spare Twitch Prime, so if you guys just want to press it, I love you. <laughs> I know of the Twitch stream or just follow. But when it comes to all that stuff too, that we've been seeing a lot of folks out there, it's probably worth checking. Go check your stores, give them a call, do a quick drive by. Even if you guys maybe still like two or three hours from now, we may actually still even be seeing stock tapering on in throughout the next maybe two days or so, depending if some stores have local availability or not. And overall, I do think this actual walk-in event went pretty good. So you want to what made your thumbs up on that? As I mentioned, if you guys sat out there, had pictures, want to tweet me pictures, send me your stocks, wherever you guys can. Last note before we do other quick news for the video, if you guys also participate, Many, many stores are saying that the managers are allowed to go and turn stuff the next day. So if say you guys go buy a console bundle for $700, you don't want to have Ghost of Tsushima, you don't want Far Cry, it basically means you guys just go and return it the next day as long as you maintain your receipts. Sometimes they're able just to go and replace it with other games, which is, I mean, not bad. You're probably going to be buying games and getting games if you guys are buying a console. And some stores are also doing full refunds. Of course, so that does depend on your store. If your store is a bunch of like, you know, like they kind of want to go by the book, they may not return it. But we've seen many people being able to go and return it so far, either later on throughout the day or just tomorrow. So be on the lookout for that. And as well, quick also reminder too, we do have the ongoing PlayStation Direct right now. Uh, I think as of right now, at least at the time I'm recording this video, it's not sold out. I'll let you guys know later on. So we have two things to be on the lookout for. Very small chance in case they may go public and may do a public queue right afterwards. So we still have not seen any of those as of so far since they started going. And as well, we also can still be anticipating the emails. If you guys go and check your email, maybe as of right now, see if your spam folder or promotions to folder actually has any stock in there and see if you guys can go maybe weasel on in for the like the last second PS Direct queue. We also did actually have a little bit of PlayStation drops going on as of, as of last night, we did have the Sam's Club. So don't have to worry about that unless they want to work in a Liolo Xbox Series X. No Best Buy as of now, but they sometimes have another like two hours or so, although it looks more on the unlikely side. And, uh, and online came in very clutch and actually had some interesting things. We saw Xboxes and like a little bit of a PS5 kind of like like a little mini alert on it too as well. And we also saw a few other various places mixed down in with the PS5s. We're still going to be anticipating a lot more information for both walk-ins. So we'll give you guys the best information we can. We'll probably have a weekly recap video up in a few hours too as well. Later on throughout tonight, it's been the lookout for that. But we'll definitely be tracking some walk-ins and we'll definitely also be tracking in a lot of other various things too as well, such as more target information if we can find some throughout this weekend and a few other various places too as well. But like I said, if you guys go to your local stores, if you guys are in the participating areas, 
Let me know how it goes. Let me know if there's still stack. We're seeing many, many reports of people still having stack, so it might be worth checking and seeing. As well, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys all have a good rest of your days, nights. We'll have a few more videos up on the channel, so be stay tuned for that. Subscribe for the PS5 giveaway. Amazon links down below for the PS5 disc digital console controller as well. Sign up for Weeble. The boss $100. Coinbase, guys, go buy $100 worth of any cryptocurrency. If you guys go get free Bitcoin. And Twitter and Twitch room down below. In case you guys want to follow, leave a like on the video if you guys would like. Love you guys.